Welcome, ladies and gentlemen. I want to say thank you for being here. Thank you for being back, Virgos. This is your business, career, and finance reading. Um, this has to do with people um, who has their own business and people on the work floor. Um, it doesn't really matter if you're a freelancer, whoever you are, um, um, professional people, um, this is all for you, the, the housewives who have their business, uh, this is all for you. Now, welcome, ladies and gentlemen. Let's go into reading. Uh, if you'd like um, um, to align with me, you can choose this. Now, whatever is happening and transpiring, um, you Virgos, it's all about dealing with with some new opportunities that is going to be coming in okay so a lot of you virgos there are new opportunities coming in okay so you have a choice virgos um because there are new um opportunities that are coming in you can see them in the second week in business that is coming up and i see some of you on the work floor you're listening to your own intuition but the opportunities this is a month of opportunities and a new start for you um for you virgos okay so you have opportunities coming in some of these opportunities are really good opportunities especially opportunities with a huge um corporation okay and this is sweet this is this is an opportunity um where it could be with government institutes or organization virgos so they could be wanting to take you in okay so um they see your potential and they could be want to take you in now virgos this is a sweet opportunity take it so in the third week this is really a sweet opportunity take it because you're going to be feeling the connection between you and this organization you're going to be feeling as if you were fit to be in this organization okay so let's look at this what is your best week um your best week is going to be the fourth week your best week in business or on the work floor is going to be in the fourth week now what is happening and transpiring is that uh, th there is there is information that is going to be coming out there are there are things on the work floor that is kept from you that is going to be coming out now whatever these things that is kept from you on the work floor i see you know that something people are not saying exactly what is going on and I see that you're kind of keeping yourself to yourself. Mom is the word in the first week, whether it's in business, whether it's in la in 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 uh, on the work floor. Mom is the word. I see there's a lot that is going on on the work floor, and you're like, I feel as if something is not right in balance. You are right, Virgo. So don't worry about it. It's it, it's going to be coming out. We're going to be seeing because something is happening and it's going to be coming out as we look at the second week the second week is about truths it's about some uh secret that was untold it can be in the work floor it can be about a contract that you have taken um it can that you receive an offer but there was there was secrets around why you received the offer so let's say that you apply for a job you receive this job but they took you on um, because maybe you have a lot of uh, um, experience with something, okay? But do they think that you passed by the team? That is another thing. So be careful in the second week because whatever you sign in the second week, there is a reason behind that so let's say you sign something in the second week there is going to be a reason like people you're going to be finding out that you know when you start like they people don't know what they're all about they don't know the procedure of this job and that sort of a thing so be aware of that now the third week is wonderful because the third week is good because the third week people in power um or people in government institutes say if you work for a government institute your organization they are going to be 
um it, it is about wow okay this person has really um work ethic is just so um on the top so it is a sort of recognition but um it is also a sort of wow this person really they're 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 really focusing they're really doing a really a good job and they are going to be offering you something like they are going to be saying hey do you we have a problem at so and such office and you know is it possible you could go there two and three days out of the week and what is happening really virgos is that they realize that you're seeing a lot of stuff that they weren't um they weren't aware of they, they, they did not it wasn't brought to their attention and because of this i see that they are going to be offering you to you know either it's not really relocation because i don't see huge travel but they're going to ask you can you go to that office in this week they need extra help and that sort of a thing but if it's a government or a huge corporation I am seeing that they are going to be offering you something that you are going to be blown away. You're not going to be realized what, but the offer in the third week is good. Whatever is transpiring in the third week, it is good. It is that you are going to be connected with the right people. Now, in um, the four weeks in business, there's some sadness in business. We're going to be looking out, but on the work floor, I see a lot of you or your performance on the work floor. I see you overcoming issue. I see you making new um, procedure. I see you are on top of the game at work. But in and in in the in business, I see some sadness. And the third, the fourth week, okay. In the fifth week, I see you're trying to find in a sprint. I see a lot of stuff you need to get clear up um, in the, um, the fifth week. I see you're trying to find inner strength to move through all of the tasks that you need to do. It's as if they throw all the tasks at you. At business, I see some of you are heartbroken with a queen of cups. Whoever this queen of cups is, I see you're very heartbroken with this queen of cups because whatever is transpiring is as if this queen of cups and you had, had spoken of um, we're working together or we're supposed to do some work for you. She is not coming up um, with what she, she promised. And um, what she brought forward is not really what you were looking for. So be aware. So as we look at the two first week, I am seeing that there are things that is unknown to you in the first week in the, in the second week some of you are going to be receiving an offer and the offer that you're going to be receiving the it has the energy of the truth is going to be coming out so let, let's say that you realize that the first week and the second week there's kind of weird things um on the work floor and things that people are not saying everything and you, you you realize that things are kind of off on the work floor don't worry about that because you will find out what it is okay and you're going to be finding that out in the second week as you come to the end of the second week some of you are going to be receiving a contract but there is a reason for this contract there is fine prints behind this contract there is it's as if they realize that you have a lot of experience so they're going to be taking you on but uh, is you know they it's as if they want in, they want your information and this is why they're going to be taking you on and i would say do the best job you know but you could be at this place for a very long time so i see some of you applying to a government institution organization and you're writing a very good cv um and this is going to be it's going to be a yes okay so i see some of you could be applying to a government institute your organization you're writing a very good cv and i'm seeing yes it's you're going to be one of the person who's going to be picked out of this it's going to be a yes and i see that it's going to be the right fit okay um you're going to be picked out some of you could be going in to sign your contract it's going to be the right fit for you guys 
okay this is going to be it's as if um this contract was meant to be if it's as if this is where you were meant to work now for the people who are already on the work floor i see you might be meeting the your twin flame or soulmate again ladies and gentlemen if you can do without that then you know please some of you who are partnered up in business um which your husband or wife um i see this could be good okay oh jesus i'm asking you guys please no no you know be careful but the people who are going to be working for a huge corporation this is going to be good and if you have your own business it's going to be a good week some of you you could be disappointed in a working relationship with a cancer whoever this cancer is is a pisces is, is pisces cancer or scorpion i see you're going to be very disappointed with the the work of this cancer okay it's as if some of you could be helping this person out or some of you um some of you could be really helping this person out really trying to bring this person on board but it's as if their performance is not up the level if you hire this pisces cancer scorpion woman she's 45 years and older i don't see that she's going to give you um the right product or the product is not going to be completed or she is going to be um not ready with whatever you have asked so you're going to be a very disappointing person dealing with an an aries leo or as a, a pisces cancer or a scorpion um some of you on the work floor i see um this um aries leo or sagittarius person is uh, um leaving okay it is definitely a leo person i see that she is leaving and whatever that is transpire i see that she and um this queen of cups so, um it is a leo and i see there is really some situation that is happening and the night of this is here so i am not trusting this so let me look at this because some of you are dealing with and Aries Leo or Sagittarius on the work floor and you you need to find strength dealing with these two women they are um Aries Leo or Sagittarius and a, a Cancer a Pisces Cancer or Scorpion okay you need to, you're trying to find inner strength to deal with this person or these people whoever they are so let's see who are these two people because it, I know that one is a Leo for sure okay this is a Sagittarian for some of you. And um, I see there is no communication between you and this person. And it is definitely with your business. So the cancer is definitely someone you had asked to, to help you with something in your business. This could be um, your secretary. This could be your personal um, assistant, whoever this person is. But, you know there's no communication it's like this person you can't have any contact with this person you can't find this person and that is kind of blocking you because you expected this person to deliver on time for some of you and some of you are really having a hassle getting through to this person i there is no communication so whatever is transpiring and happening some of you are dealing with an aries a sagittarius on the work floor and a leo and it's as if you don't you really do not want to communicate with these people for whatever the reason is you really don't want to communicate with these people so whatever is transpiring just know that the universe knows what is best okay let it go just let the, the month run off and if you'd like a personalized read and always just connect with the channel and ask for your personal reason I am saying Bye, until next time.